Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we will be going uh, through Cambridge IGCSE Mathematics paper uh, 1 2 from May June 2024 series, right. So, uh, let us start, you all know the instructions. So, the first question that we have here write the number. Uh, write the number uh, this number in words. So, we will see like you have to make always pair of threes 3 here you see this is uh, thousands and this is millions. So, this is 31 million 31 millions and 72 thousand. Seventy-two thousand. Okay. Now the second question: We have this angle here. Measure the size of the angle. So you can easily do that. I am not going to show you here, but you pro, uh, place your protractor here. So then you measure this angle. So this is I have measured this one on paper. So, this is 46 degree around 46 degree measure the length of a b length of a b from here to point b if you measure this this is in millimeter. So, this is 84 that is 8.4 centimeter. So, 84 mark the midpoint of the line. So, then you take the midpoint uh, in the middle that will be 4.2 and mark it as m. So, this side is going to be 4.2 this is 4.2 or you can say 42 uh, millimeters right. Draw a line through m that is perpendicular to line a b. So, on this a b you just put your set square here then you can draw a line which is at angle of 90 here right. Now, number 3 find the value of the reciprocal of 0 0.4. So, 0 0.4 first of all we can write 0 0.4 as 4 over 10 then the reciprocal. So, the reciprocal is going to be 10 over 4 uh, you can simplify uh, divide by 2 it will be 5 over 2 which is 2.5. As you can see our question is in decimal. So, our answer also uh, supposed to be in decimal. So, 2.5 is the answer right. Now, number 4 write these numbers in order starting with the smallest. So, the easiest way uh, uh, to make them in uh, look same right this is percentage this is fraction this is uh, in standard form and this is also in fraction. So, uh, divide 6 by 7 just use calculator. So, this comes out to be 8.8571 and if you write this one uh, minus 1. Uh, so, as you see here uh, 1 0 this side. So, this is going to be a 0 0.86. 11 divided by 13 gives us 0 0.366 and this is divide by 100. So, this is 80, uh, 0 0.865. Now, this there are 4 decimal places here 2, 4 and 3. So, we will make them same. Uh, we can just add here uh, the number of zeros like uh, if I add here number of zeros to make it same. So, 2 zeros I am adding here here we have already 4. So, here 1 0. So, as you can see now here the smallest one decimal part is same 0 0 and 0 in all 4. Uh, so, which is smallest here you can see here uh, this one is 0 0.36. So, this is num at number 1 after that we have 0 0.88571 uh, 8571. So, this will come at number 2 then at number 3 is this 8600 this is 8650. So, this is number 3 and this is number 4. So, now remember that when you write this uh, you should have uh, like uh, the same uh, form of the the that original form. So, the first one we are not going to write 3.66 we are going to write down 11 over 13. So, first we have 11 over 13 second number we have 6 over 7, then we have 8.6 10 raise to power minus 1, then 
five percent, right? Now, number five, uh, draw all lines of symmetry in in this quadrilateral. So, line of symmetry divides the line into two equal parts, right? So that it comes the reflection so of each other. So one, if you see, and then. it is like this as this quadrilateral is a square. So, it will have four lines of symmetry like this write down the mathematical name of the quadrilateral that has rotational symmetry of order 2. Uh, so, there may be many. So, I can write some of them like here uh, rectangle rectangle has line of symmetry 2 also the rhombus. Okay, and also parallelogram, you can, but we need to write only one here. Okay, number 6 we have here and the temperature at midnight is negative 4, the temperature at noon is 25 degree Celsius, work out the difference between these two temperatures. So, difference we are going to have like 25 degree Celsius, always do not get confused with that, this is 25, let us say here 25 on positive side and here is negative 4 on other side right. So, we are looking for this difference. So, that means we have to add this 25 plus 4 it is 29 degrees that is the difference. Number 7 a gardener uh, charges dollar 6.5 for each hour 6.55 for each hour he works plus a fixed charge of 15.5. Fifteen point five zero. Calculate the total amount that he charges when he works for four hour. So this is the fixed charge. As you can see, it's written fixed charge, right? So dollar fifteen point five zero. This is fixed. Then plus uh, whatever he charges per hour. Per hour is six point five five. So is working for four hours. So that is going to be four times uh, six point five five, right? just plug in the values and then you will get it it comes out to be 14.41.70 easy now number 8 uh, jonah has dollar 750 uh, he spends 1 by 4 of his money on travel so he uh, spends on uh, travel this one 1 by 4 he spends uh, 1 by 4 on money on travel and some of the money on food so, some on food uh, he now has this is the money that he is left with work out the fraction of 750 spent on food the fraction of this that is spent on food right. So, now uh, we will take it um, the travel whatever he is travels he has 750. So, uh, the money that he uh, spent on travel to travel he spent 1 by 4 of the money that is of 750 that comes out to be 187.50 right. Then uh, that some money on food now he has 437. So, 437 he has then how, what is the total amount that he has uh, now. So, total amount that he has now I mean like the spent and remaining we will see. Uh, so, 187.5 and then he has 437.5. So, this is 625 right. So, this is the amount uh, that we are looking for the fraction of this. So, the remaining amount the fraction he spent on work out the fraction on of this that he spent on food. So, sum of his money it is written here and he has this one plus he has that uh, that he spent on travel. So, the remaining amount is going to be uh, the fraction that we need is going to be uh, 750 minus 625 out of total that is 750 sorry 750. So, once you calculate this, this is a 750 minus 625 125 over 750. So, divide by 5. So, this will be 
25 over divide by 5 750 divided by 5 150 25 times 6 so this is going to be 1 over 6 we will leave it as fraction because he has asked us the fraction now, number 9, a delivery driver records the number of pizzas uh, he, she delivers each month or for one year. So, this is the uh, number of uh, pizzas dribbled and delivered, uh, complete the stem and leaf diagram for 2. So, uh, the easy way you start whatever you have here, first one is 48. So, 48 I am writing in this here, just write on side because we have to rearrange. Then we have 44 will also go here 4, 39, 39 is 9 is going to be here, 28 in the first one here, 8, 57 in the column of 50, uh, 22 is here, 36, 6 is going to go here. Then we have 41, 41 is here, 54, 54, 4 I am writing here, 57 will also come here and then 49 is here, 52 is here, right. So, now we just rearrange. So, 2 should come 22, then 8, then 6 and 9. Remember, it should be in the uh, ascending order 4, 8, 9 uh, and then we have 2, 4, 7 and 7, right. Now, find the median. So, for the median, uh, we have to take the uh, half of that. The total number of terms we have, uh, to how many are they? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 times 2, 12. So, for a year that is 12 months. So, 12 divided by 2, it comes out to be 6. So, this that is going to be 6 and 7th, the, because this is even number. So, 6 plus 7th value over 2, right. 6 and 7th, let us see. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 is this 44 and 48. So, we are going to add these. It is going to be 44 plus 48 over 2, which is 46. So, final answer is 46, right. Now, number 10, work out A minus B. We have A, A is 5 minus 7 minus b, b is 6 and minus 7. So, this is 5 minus 6, this is negative 7 plus 7 minus 1 and 0, minus 1 and 0, right. Now, number 11, uh, these are the first 4 terms of the sequence 23, 17, uh, 11 and 5. Uh, write down the next two terms. Now, we need to observe the pattern here. So, if you go there 11 minus 5, this is 6, 17, 6. So, that means we are reducing by 5. So, next term is going to be 5 minus 6 that is negative 1 and then negative 1 minus 6 that is going to be negative 7. So, negative 1 and negative 7 is the next one. Find the nth term. Now, the formula of nth term is A plus n minus 1 into d. Uh, a is the first term and first term we have 23 and n minus 1 and the common difference is negative 6, right. So, expand the bracket this is 23 minus 6 n when you multiply this one this will become 6. So, this is 23 plus 6 29 minus 6 n. So, 29 minus 6 n. Now, number 12, write down 0 0.0462 into correct two significant figures. Two significant figures are going to be here and the next number is uh, 2 which is less than uh, 5. So, that will remain as it is though and it will be 0 0.046, two significant figures, right. Now, on the Venn diagram shade A, A uh, union B. A union B means combination of A and B. So, the whole of this A and B. So, we need to shade this part. Okay. Now, factorize completely. 
So, we will see what is common here. So, uh, 10 I can directly see 10 is common and x is common inside we will have 2 minus uh, for and again it will be 9 actually 10 is common then it will be 9 x right 10 times 2 20 10 times 9 90 square. So, it is going to be 10 into 2 minus 9 x. And now, number 15 describe a type of correlation between the speed of runner and the time taken to complete the race. So, if the speed is more then time taken will be less. So, this is a, a negative correlation we will write down negative correlation type of correlation is negative. Now, number 16 uh, a circle has an area of 36 pi squared find the circumference of the circle give your answer in terms of pi. So, as we know that the formula of circumference of the circle is 2 pi r right 2 pi and radius is ok radius we do not have radius first of all we need to find out the radius uh, because we are given the area area of the circle is pi r squared. So, uh, which is 36 pi and we have pi r square. So, r square is going to be 36 pi over pi pi is gone. So, r square is 36 and then r is going to be 6 we are taking only positive value. So, r is 6. So, we that sub we can substitute here times 6 6 times 2 12 pi. So, the question says that give answer in terms of pi. So, 12 pi is going to be the answer. Now, the circle forms the base of the cylinder with height h. So, this circle this is height h and this is the base of this. The volume of the cylinder is 540. So, volume we are given 540 pi right. So, formula of volume is pi r squared h volume of the cylinder uh, which is 54 or 540 pi. Uh, so, h we are looking for h. So, that will be 540 pi over pi r squared. So, pi and pi is gone. So, 540 over r, r is 6. So, this 6 times 6 36. So, when you simplify 6 times 9 90, 90 over 6 it is 15. So, height is going to be 15 centimeter right. So, that is it for this video remaining question we are going to do in the next one. I hope you guys understood everything let me know in the comment section kindly subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends. Be blessed guys see you in the next video.